All right, we got a sus filled lightning round today. All right, anyways, first question, and this is from Blaze. Blaze. Blaze, that's our buddy. Would you give up weed or masturbation for one month if you had to pick one to give up? I'd probably for do 30 days. I'd probably do uh weed for sure because like shit. Dude, I That's know, tough. Like I I don't really I don't really have sex right now. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm going to be fucked. I would be fucked. Yo, okay, but let me tell you, actually, before before you say that, I actually, if I were you, I'd give up masturbation. Oh. And the reason I say is this. What guys don't realize is, like, dude, when you're single and you get into a habit of masturbating every single day, you don't take chances. Yeah. When you stop masturbating, you'll be surprised at how much ballsier you'll get with girls. Really. You really? don't realize, like, yo, your confidence actually is so much higher What when you're not masturbating. Oh, fuck, I'm going to try that. So when I was single for a while and I was like, fuck, like, I really need to start doing something, I actually, like, took a pause from masturbating because I was like, I'm going to force myself to take chances. Yeah. Because your body will, like, you will see something you like and you'll, like, even, even if it's over the internet, you'll start sending riskier messages. Wow. You know what I mean? You okay, understand what I'm okay, saying? Yeah, yeah, but if yeah. you're masturbating every single day, you're taking the edge off every single day. So anytime you get into a situation that could be potentially new, you're going to always revert back to being comfortable because yeah. you're like, I already got my rocks off. I feel good. I don't need this. You know, no, that makes sense. You know, I was actually thinking about like stopping like both of those. Cause you know what they, Interesting. they what they give you, I, I, I think is kind of negative at, at, at certain points. Yeah, make because, sure you're talking into this. Oh, oh, I'm pretty I, sure. No, you were. Oh, I just oh, didn't oh. know if it was the side. Oh, 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 I don't know why I touched your microphone. I'm sorry. It's like backseat <laughs> recording. <laughs> but but no. <laughs> anyways, I feel like I feel like both of these things gives you in, instant gratification. Like that maybe like or re it, it rewards you for like even if you had like nothing to be rewarded for. Like, You're talking about if we stopped both of those. No, I'm saying I'm saying both of those things give you a reward that may not have been earned. Facts. Like so, getting is you talking about okay. I know the whole it, you know ejaculation thing. I get that reward piece, but explain to me how the dopamine's like if you if you oh. smoke, you're still getting like reward in your brain. Like oh, the chemicals oh, are oh, being oh. released where you're like being rewarded. So you're like mentally ejaculating. Yes. In your own mind. Exactly. Like so, you're ejaculating in your own head. <laughs> when you smoke weed, when you, you smoke ejaculate weed in your own head. <laughs> it's just an explosion in your own fucking mind. But yeah, I feel like that's that's maybe not good. I feel like I feel like So weed, you're gonna take both off. I, I was actually thinking about completely like Taking, You're just gonna change your whole life. Take it, take <laughs> Jay's it. like, fuck, I'm changing everything, bro. That's everything it. after I, after that, after that, I was like over it. I was over it. I have to no change. No more it. masturbation, no more weed. Dude, I'm looking to take out every pleasure that is unearned <laughs> out of my life. Anything that is pleasurable that I shouldn't like. Oh my god. Like like watching TV. Like what interesting. I don't okay. know. I feel so like, like fucking no pleasure. No pleasure. Just no short term how, pleasure. How would how All long term? How yeah, like how would you act if you got no pleasure? Like in the fucking insane. I would I'd be insane. <laughs> like, 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 I literally just look like a crackhead everywhere. I like, go. Yo, I need the pleasure. Yeah, I need something. But I feel like you'll get pleasure out of the like like looking at trees and shit. Oh my god. I feel Jay. like that's Jesus how Christ. that's what it, you it's would turn into. Shrooms. <laughs> Like, bro, I would just look at the trees and be happy. I, would, <laughs> I haven't masturbated in months. <laughs> I look at leaves now and I'm fucking so happy. Dude, that shit turns me on, bro. I, if I had to really pick, though, uh, you know, I actually think I would take the break from weed, too. I, but I'll, I actually, with you, maybe maybe we'll do it one month. We'll, yeah. we'll give up both. Yeah, I'm down for the to, podcast. Why, yeah, why don't we give up both for the podcast? Because I, I, I'd be curious about weed just because now I've been smoking pretty much every single night. Mm -hmm. It's not necessarily a bad thing because at the end of the day, I, I'm really good about making it a reward for yes. myself. So you actually get all your work done. Yeah, I, I, I can't yeah. do that. I, I like I can't smoke and like do my things. No, and I think that like the people some people I talk to have like said that like they'll smoke in the morning and I think yeah. like, that type of shit like will definitely fuck you up in Absolutely. the long term. Absolutely. Absolutely. I I just think yo know, that's that's what I'm saying. For me it's more just like a nighttime like yeah. okay, I've really went through my whole day. Yeah, exactly. I needed just a moment to chill. I mean, there's people out there who probably have like a glass of wine or like yeah, exactly. you know a drink. It's kind of exactly. like the same thing. Same at thing. Night. Same thing. But yeah, I mean, it would be really interesting to see how my sleep would be better. Yeah, that how would like be my you, you, you know my brain just functioning more. Yeah, the masturbation piece is like well, <laughs> fuck. It really would push me to maybe try to 
bang, bang more. Yeah. What I, about that no could come? Be dangerous though. No come. That's fucking nuts. Like you're talking about just like no come for a whole month. So that includes yeah. sex. Yeah. Yeah. Who? I'd be wound up. Dude, you know what I mean? Be I'd intense. be wound up. That maybe we'll uh, we, we should try we that. Should, we should do it. We should do it in small increments. Yeah. We should week. do it for like a week. Yeah. And see no how it come goes. week. <laughs> We'll do it. All right. I, let's plan it next. Anyways, okay. next question. And this is from Lauren K. Thanks, Lauren, for the question. You're, you're a sensation. <laughs> <laughs> How tall is too tall for girls? What would you say? Why you why can't you pick it on me? Because I'm short. I mean, what, what, what would you say? <laughs> no, what would I know, you say? I know, I know. I'm going to answer. Anybody taller so, than you? N- well, yes. Okay. Well, here's the thing. I don't think that any girl really likes a guy that's shorter than them. Some probably. Some do. probably. But and not I've actually, most. You know what's funny? I've actually met a girl that, that has. But I would say nine out of ten yeah. will want a guy that's taller yeah. than them. Makes sense. They want to be yeah. you know, the one cuddled and whatever yeah. else. Too tall? I think anything really over like six. Uh, yeah. Yeah. If you're over like six, at the end of the day, though, if like, bro, if you're over six, you have to, you're going to find a guy that's over yeah, six. Yeah. If you're you over just find a dude, girl, honestly, you're going to find a guy that's taller than you. It's if, it. If you're over six, honestly, like, you should be happy because yeah. you're going to have kids that are fucking athletes. Massive. That's, I feel <laughs> that's like, sick. I feel like, like, because especially if you date someone taller than you, yeah, exactly. You, you're you're going to breed athletes. Athletes. So yes, you have a superpower in your own little right. Yes, it, I I think it's you know what it's it's kind of sucks though. It's like it's kind of like being a short guy, right? Where you know if you're too short as a guy, it really limits your 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 opportunities. There's a lot of people out there that won't date you just because they're shorter. Yeah. And for girls, you know what I mean. If you're a girl, it's like six foot plus. I mean, what do you? I mean, you really only could go after guys that are six foot plus, and I don't think that's the norm. Would Would you date a uh, like six foot plus girl? I I talk about this all the time. This is such an interesting thing because I think I'm I'd be really picky about the 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 girl. Yeah. So like I'm be down I'm down Amazon. for her to be, yeah I'm down for her to be six foot because I think it would be so beast. Yeah. Just like yeah, think yeah, about yeah, me yeah. walking into a room, just holding her. I'm hand. like five eight. She's like six two. You know what I mean, right? And she just like we just like walk into the air. Like I just look like a beast that I was able to pull a girl that does that tall. Like they're gonna be like this this dude fucks. You know what I mean. <laughs> And then, like, if she, like, somebody fucked with me, I'd be like, babe, him. <laughs> Beat his ass. <laughs> yeah. Like, I don't have to do any of the heavy lifting. That's true. Anytime I want cereal. Yeah. Easy access. I don't need to- <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>, cereal. <laughs> anytime, anytime I want cereal. Anytime I want cereal, I don't have to jump on the counter anymore. Yeah. <laughs> I can Dude, just have her do all hilarious. the tall things I need. I mean, yeah. And maybe I'll go on her shoulders I, at the I, I feel like it would be pretty cool to like date like somebody not like it's or not just at least list. at least like have sex with like that's yes. It is on my bucket list girl. to have sex with a girl that's over six foot. For me to have sex with a girl that's over six foot would be fucking hysterical. <laughs> like in my I just can't even imagine. Like her legs are like falling. You guys off could the probably end. do like different like positions that normally normal people couldn't do. See, people talk about this. I don't believe that. I Maybe. feel like you could. The only Proportion. one that I'm, But here's the thing. If she's that much taller than me, like, what can we do that's different? I don't know. Maybe she, she could, Maybe she, she could like, carry me and, like, hold me. Yes, yes. And, she, like, fuck herself <laughs> with me. <laughs> she could do a triangle choke, bro. Yeah. <laughs> so, at the end of the day, would I date a girl that's that tall? She'd have to be dope as fuck. You know what I mean? I... I I'm not gonna say no. I'm not gonna sit here and say no. But at the end of the day, I'm attracted to short girls yeah. because that's what guys want. Guys want a girl that's short. Well, no, you know what I mean? I, it's, it's we're not hard. trying to be mean to like talk. You're like, no. yo, I'm attracted to short girls because that's what guys like. No, no, no. I'm not saying that's what guys like. I'm just saying I would prefer a girl that I could yes. you know, handle. Yeah. Whereas like a six foot girl could maybe like put her arm out and like stop me from getting to her. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> she just like hold my head. Stop. Yeah. <laughs> Like, if she was bullying me, I wouldn't yeah, know what to do. Yeah, she was bullying That's what I'm saying. Like, I wouldn't even be, like, the man in my own house. You know? <laughs> She's like, go take out the trash. I'm like, I'm right. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. Um, last one and the most sus one. And this is from Cass. Cass is our, our good friend. She's hella fucking sus. She comes up with good questions, though. This was a great this question. This one's a great question. It's so I mean, hard. compare... I don't know if people would say this is a great question, but on this show, yes, on this question. show, it's a great question. Yeah, would you rather <laughs> eat your mom's or your dad's ass? Well, for me, considering it is Father's Day, I'm Jesus going. With, Christ. I'm going with the dad. I I think just as a dude, you kind of have to just pick your dad. It's I so like, weird. I feel like it's, it's weirder. With, you know what I mean? I 
I couldn't do it to my mom. You know what I mean? It's just like if I really, <laughs> I, couldn't do it. I just couldn't. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's I honestly so probably couldn't weird. do it either way. No, bro. hell no, hell no. <laughs> That's the weirdest shit. Imagine that shit. That no. Oh, dude, I'm imagining it right now. No, it's so wait, bad. Wait, it's so that. bad. <laughs> I can't think of it. I can't think of it. <laughs> like I, I just, I don't know. Like, what would? I don't even know the conversation that would have to happen. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. What situation anything. would you be yes, in where there, you're like, I, I just, I just wouldn't know. Yo, what if, what I if probably would take, I'd probably do suicide. That's what I'm life. saying. If, if they were like, yo, we're going to kill you if you don't. Oh, I would it's, probably it's either, it's either death, eat your mom's ass or your dad's ass. You'd what? pick death. I'd pick death. Fuck. I don't know. I'd probably I, pick Yo, that. you wouldn't really know until, dude, until, be, until somebody's got their fucking hand on the gun in the back of your true. head. You don't really know. But I'd probably be fucked for the rest of my life. I wouldn't want to have that in my memory. So I would die rather that than is, have that in my memory. That's fucking true. That shit would be so fucking oh, dude, weird. Dude, every time you close your eyes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you just see your you see your, your dad's, dad's ass. ass. You just you <laughs> see in it. your mouth. Ah, <laughs> there's not a lot to even say about this question because I don't I don't want to like deep dive why <laughs> deep I dive. I don't want to deep dive why I would pick either one. All I know is is that I couldn't do it to my own mom, so I think just automatically I have to cancel that out. That's you know what I mean. It. Just because I feel like I, so like let's say you're a daughter though, would you? I think you would eat your mom's ass, right? Like if you were a girl, yeah, would you eat your mom's ass? Probably, right? Probably, it would be weirder to eat your dad's. Yeah, 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 probably. Because I think like when you do it with the same sex, it's like, all right, something's already funky here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, but yeah, what if yeah. you were gay? I would. Would you eat your mom's I, ass? No, I think that that. Or would you eat your dad's? I ass? I think you'd still eat your dad's ass. That's true. It's like you're used to it. Yeah. I, <laughs> wait, no. Oh no. <laughs> I don't. I, I don't know. Dude, that's a good question to ask. Yeah, this is why you know. See, these are the the tough questions that need to be answered. Yes. So thank you, Cass. Yeah, for, thanks. Thanks for, for making us, making answer, us this. answer that. That's fucking disgusting.